बिस्मिल्ल रहीम वेलकम टू बेसिक इंजीनियरिंग मैथमेटिक्स चैप्टर नंबर थ्री एंड दिस इज़ द सेकंड एपिसोड एंड लेट्स टॉक अबाउट फर्स्ट ऑफ ऑल द टॉपिक्स वी आर गोइंग टू डिस्कस इन दिस एपिसोड टुडेज टॉपिक इज़ वेरी सिंपल दैट इज़ द सिग्निफिकेंट फिगर्स एंड द डेसिमल प्लेसेज एंड द रेलिवेंट एग्जाम्पल्स एज यूजल एट द एंड आई विल प्रोवाइड यू सम क्वेश्चन एंड आंसर फॉर योर प्रैक्टिस एंड द मेन टॉपिक ऑफ टूडे इज द सिग्निफिकेंट फिगर्स एंड डेसीमल प्लेसेज वॉट इज़ द सिग्निफिकेंट फिगर्स and decimal places this is actually a li little bit and very simple difference you just need to click a point so that you can understand the basic difference between them a terminating first of all let's start from a terminating decimal fraction a terminating decimal fraction is a fraction like this uh, in which there is a finite number of digits for example this is 3 to the 16 Uh, e equals to by change converting this mixed number into decimal fraction it will become 3.1825 and this is uh, this will be ended when we divide this uh, for example when we divide 3 by 16 it will the answer will be 1.0.1825 then we append 3 uh, to the answer and the answer is uh, exactly this is exactly divisible and the answer is not continuing or we are not uh, we don't need to round off this answer because this this answer has a finite number of digits so a number which can be expressed exactly as a decimal fraction is called a terminating decimal fraction for ter terminating decimal or uh, for example here it is a fraction in the form of fraction it is called terminating decimal fraction or here it is just terminating decimal but uh, main thing here you just need to know that after this decimal point there are just finite numbers just uh, or you in other words this can be expressed in exactly uh, a, a number but not a round off without round off so in non terminating decimals there are certain numbers and numbers are don't uh, going to end uh, there is no maybe uh, in finite numbers or Uh, they are continue maybe forever or in in other words we can say that they do, uh, don't come to an end or if they do it is after a long interval and we do not go in uh, and we do not take risk in dividing dividing and uh, up even our calculator is limited to up to certain uh, digits for example this is a, a this is a, this uh, 3.14 so on in this case has a uh, uh, finite doesn't have a finite number of digits but let's suppose if this if this remember i'm saying if this will uh, come to an end it will after a long interval so this is uh, uh, an example of non terminating decimal fraction so it non terminating decimal fraction is a num uh, uh, is a number which cannot be expressed exactly as a decimal fraction is called a non terminating decimal this is the way uh, we already discussed to convert this uh, mixed number into a uh, non terminating decimal this is a non terminating decimal it is basically continuing decimal and we did this by round off and the process by conversion is this 7 um, is the outside uh, and uh, uh, we have to put 5 inside this radical sign and the answer will be 0.7142 and so on we just append one here due to this one non terminating decimals numbers can be expressed in two ways depending upon the accuracy required so basically we can because you know that these numbers are uh, continuously continuously uh, increasing and uh, there is no, uh, pattern uh, doesn't come to an end so we uh, because in when we are solving examples when we are going to solve the questions we definitely don't have enough space and don't have enough uh, ability to write maybe we can say that don't want to mess with other numbers so we need to uh, put them on a put them on a graphical view or a cop on a notebook so that we just want to Uh, precisely write them in terms of uh, round off and there are two techniques used in this scenario in terms of decimal places we are uh, have to round off or in terms of significant so this is the main topic and in the next slide we will try to 
cover the basic difference in terms of the decimal places we will count the, the figures or the numbers after the decimal means to say correct up to a certain numbers of figures after decimal in terms of the significant figures using round of techniques to correct up to a certain figures first of all i am going to tell you the basic difference between the significant figures correction uh, correct uh, and and a decimal uh, places when we talk about the significant figures up to a certain fi uh, significant figures it means that we have to start counting from uh, the left side uh, before even before this dot uh, this is 1.714 for example in this case we are going to uh, round off this to four digits then it means we have to count this one also that is before this decimal one two three four and 1.714 is correct to a four significant figure so in case of the significant figures we have to count this one also that is before this dot or a decimal point but when we count after the that uh, only the numbers that are after the, the this decimal point for example here these are this is 714 only three uh, uh, digits so we will say that this is correct up to up to a three decimal places so this is the basic difference but when we count uh, the digits that are um, before this dot uh, that are called the significant figures when when we count uh, the, the digits that are after this dot that are in uh, this is called the decimal places correct up to a certain decimal places remember that when there are uh, there will be some zero zero point seven one four zero point zero seven one four the zeros will not be included in the significant figures i will also explain this uh, point in the upcoming slide because I have an example of this scenario the last digit this is there are the few cases and or a few rules when we are going to convert uh, this uh, uh, using uh, convert a long or a huge term in and to a precise uh, or a shorter a shorter uh, term or a up to a certain correct up to a certain significant figures we have to follow these rules the last digit in the answer is unaltered if the next digit on the right is in a group of 0 1 2 3 4 means to say if the last digit is below than 5 then the last digit is unaltered for example here in this case 1.7142 the next because we are going to round off this to up to a three decimal places three decimal places will become th point 714 the next digit is 2 that is uh, below 5 less than 5 so the uh, last digit 4 will be unaltered 1.714 this is the answer 1.714 it is correct up to four uh, significant figures 1 2 3 4 but if we say that in terms of the decimal places so there are the three digits after the dot we can see that uh, so we can say this is correct up to three decimal places since the next digit on the right in this example is two and the previous digit is four so this is unaltered or unchanged the last digit in the answer is increased by one this is the next case second case in which it is increased by one in the previous case it is unaltered or doesn't increased but in this example it is increased by one if it is five or uh, more than five but remember that this is general uh, generally we say that uh, if the uh, next digit is uh, value is above 5 but here i write 5 because in some cases we also increase the previous uh, uh, digit the last digit if it is 5 also uh, but what in what cases we will increase and in what cases we do not increase if it is 5 we i will explain in the next slide for example 1.7142857 and we are going to round off it to five significant figures then 1 2 3 4 we have to round off it to 1.714 and we will see that what is the next digit to write after 4 that is 2 it is it belongs to the uh, sorry we are going in this example i take this uh, in this example i am going to use correct to five significant figures so one two three four five 
so five significant wickets will become 1.7142 so the next digit to the right is eight that it belongs to the family of five plus where you have a five six seven eight or nine so this is has a value great this number is greater than five or greater than five then we have to increase uh, the previous by one previous digit you can see that two is increased by one that it will become 1.7143 this is correct up to four decimal places if we count after this dot one two three four there are the four decimal places since the next digit on the right in this example is eight hence previous digit two is incremented in rounding of numbers if the first fig figure drop is five and all the figures following the five are zero or if there is no figures after the five then the last figures kept should be unchanged this is the first scenario in case of the five uh, this is what i was uh, telling you in the previous slide that for example the there are the certain category there is further categories if there is a five because five is lying in the mid between the f first group that has a value of uh, less than five one two three four and the last digit that has a value of greater than uh, four uh, sorry five that is six seven eight and nine so five is the five lies in the between the first group and the second group so five has a certain five has extra categories in which this is first category of the five in which we do not have to increase the previous digit uh, the rule is this if the next digits are zero or uh, there is no digit after the five then we have to uh, see the previous digit that is even or odd if this is even we do not going to change the previous digit for example 6.6 .6, if we are going to round up this up to a one decimal place then we have to write this like 6.6 .6 because the next digit is 5 and the all the digits after 5 is 0 and the previous is even so we can we do not change this for example if only two decimals are to be kept then 7.485 becomes 7.48 be because uh, you can see that there is uh, nothing after this 5 and the previous is even so we are not going to change this but in the second case if uh, uh, if all the digits again uh, after the 5 is 0 but the previous is odd then we are going to increase this by 1 you can see that 6.755 uh, if we are going to round up this up to three significant figures one two three six point seven five then it will become this six point seven six five is increased by one for example if only two decimals are to be kept eight point double nine five it will becomes uh, nine point double zero because this is the previous is odd and it will increased by one ninety nine is if increased by one it will become one point double zero so remember that there is a trick the trick is uh, you have to make the previous digit even if it is already even you can see that we do not change this because we want to ma make this even remember this and if it, it is not even here uh, it is 5 here it is 9 this is not even we had increased uh, it by 1 to make it even you can see that 9.00 you can see that here it 5 is changed to 6 to make it even so this is the way you can remember this easily in rounding of numbers this is the last case if the first figure drop is 5 and there is are any figures following the 5 that are not 0 this is the case in which the next because in the previous two cases we discussed if the all the uh, next digits are 0 after 5 or there is no digit after 5 then uh, the previous cases are valid but what happens when uh, uh, there are certain uh, digits are, uh, are also appended at the end of this 5 then what we have to do we there uh, this is the case if uh, there is 5 and there are any figures following the 5 that are not not 0 then the last figure cap should be increased by one for example if only one decimal is to be kept then 6.6501 becomes 6.7
if uh, there are some digits after this 5 then this will be uh, then always we are going to increase th this pre in the previous digit by 1 for example 6.6 .6 is increased increase 6 is increased by 1 then it will become 6.7 because after 5 the all these digits are not 0 here again after 5 you can see that there are 2007 so again we are going to increase this 7.49 here we are going to discuss an example express this 15.36815 uh, to correct up to two decimal places if we are going to change this correct up to two decimal places we have to start the counting after this dot that is 36 here 1 2 we have to change it this 15.36815 uh, to uh, up to 15.36 so this is the last digit 6 so watch the next that is 8 it belongs to 5 or 5 plus category then we have to increase this 6 by 1 so means to say 15.37 now it is cracked up to two decimal places second case is uh, to change this number to three significant figures 15.36815 is changed into 15.4 because the uh, next digit is uh, 6 that is belongs to 5 or 5 plus category so it means we have to add uh, or increase the previous digit by one uh, so uh, it is correct up to three significant figures one two three third case is check this uh, convert this to uh, three decimal places correction 15.36815 here uh, three decimal places means to say we have to start counting after this dot one two three so this is eight and the next digit belongs from the category four or less than four so we do not have to change the previous digit this is unchanged unaltered in this next case 15.368 it is unaltered unchanged correct to three decimal places so the next case six significant figures one two three four five six so the next is five and there is no zero uh, after this five so we have to watch the previous digit that is one so that is odd number we have to add it to be make it even to so 15.3682 to correct to six significant figures there is another example to change and turn it to four decimal places this is one two three four when we are talking about to up to a certain decimal places then we have to add these zeros also one two three four that is three and then uh, next digit belongs to five or five plus category then we have to add this it will become 0 0.0044 but remember this is the case i was talking about this is an exceptional case when we are going to discuss in case of the significant figures because zero is not a significant figure is not counted here in this example up, uh, we have to make this up to a three significant figures and if we include zero it will be 0 0.00 because we are not going to inc include these zeros as a significant figures so we have to start counting after these zeros that are non zeros and uh, start counting from a non zeros digits that is 4 3 6 these are the three digits so the next is 9 so increase by 1 0 0.00437 remember this is not a not uh, this is not correct up to six significant figures sometimes you may be confused it that it is maybe correct up to six significant figures no 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 this is uh, one two three do not start counting from one two three four five six okay but when we talk about this uh, number uh, up to a how much decimal places then zeros are included one two three four five this is correct up to five and this is correct up to four decimal places this is a practice exercise you have to try it by yourself and uh, very simple questions answers are also available so we will discuss the further continue the discussion up to next uh, in the coming episode so watch learn grow see you next